I'm Clive and I'm an osteopath. I've been an osteopath for a long time now. Um, an interesting career, it's my second career. I started out uh, not really knowing what I wanted to do at school uh, and followed more of an arts track than the sciences. Uh, ended up doing social science and ended up as teaching sociology. I realised I was in the wrong job. So I stopped and retrained and put myself through another four years of uh, university study uh, to become an osteopath. Every day is different. People walk in with a variety of different problems. Um, sometimes people may have always chronic head, headaches or neck pain. Um, sometimes we're, we're advising people about their lifestyle and their health and their nutrition and why they're uh, having trouble. You have to help people lead the healthiest life you can. Some people have trouble after a big dental extraction and they can't understand why they're getting pain in the jaw or face. Um, and uh, for other people, there's one, one of my colleagues has worked a lot with chronic fatigue syndrome. Other people get very interested in what, the way in which uh, diet and uh, lifestyle can affect our well-being. The sort of person who would get on well with osteopathy is somebody who likes problem solving, is good with their hands, likes to use their brain and their hands because we are hands-on people. Uh, in the old days, they used to call osteopaths um, ten-fingered bloodless surgery uh, in the sense that we don't cut people up, but we do use our hands to help people restore themselves back to normal health, get rid of pain and, and get back to good function. If you're interested about osteopathy, then the Institute of Osteopathy has a whole lot of stuff on there. That's our organisation. Tell you all about it. So I think one of the key things about being an osteopath, and one of the things I love about it, is that you have to be interested in people. If you are a people person, if you like people, and you're able to uh, solve problems, osteopathy is really a great career. I've been doing it for 40 years, and I still do it now as an older person, and I love it.